Hello guys, how are you all doing? Thank you to all who keep listening to my audio novels, to all those who sent donations and super thanks. Thank you thank you so much. I could not dictate each of you. You know who you are. I am very grateful for all your support. So do enjoy listening to my audio novels. Please subscribe to my channel. Audio novels. See playlist for other chapters and novels. I do not translate the novels. Credits goes to original translator and author of the novel. I only make it as an audio book so it would be easier to just listen while doing other things. Credits goes to the author of of the novel. I convert stories to audio book for mental health, for multitasking purpose, for accessibility and time saving. Listening to audio book is also beneficial for people who have disability. It improves our listening skills and improve our English comprehension, vocabulary and other things. So, thank you for listening. Thank you and thank you very much for your support. Chapter 1171 Toy Blood Cloud Palace leader is human, and he's been secretly protecting Luo Feng. Are you kidding? Who knows? The news is spread among the universe masters, and chances are it's genuine. Ha ha. No wonder that Blood Cloud Palace leader has never attacked humans. Now I know the reason. Goddamn human race. It secretly tells Blood Cloud Palace leader to attack us Northern Territory Alliance. The news kept being spread. The Divine Eye Clan and some powers in the original universe had information sharing agreements. When an young master spread the news, some of the powers that had suffered under Blood Cloud Palace leader went to question the great beings in the human race. Is Blood Cloud Palace leader human? Why do you humans let Blood Cloud Palace leader slaughter all those beings? No, you're not admitting it. Okay. Good for you. All those who went to question the human race got a similar response. Clearly, the human race wouldn't admit that Blood Cloud Palace was human, and it didn't care. When some great beings of other races asked whether they knew human Liuo Feng was with Blood Cloud Palace leader, the human race replied indifferently. We don't care who Luo Feng makes friends with. We don't have any restrictions for who human universe masters to make friends with. If he's really a friend of Blood Cloud Palace leader, we won't do anything about it. Sorry. We don't need to tell you anything. The human race didn't care about other powers. However, though Primal Chaos City leader and Void Gold Master were tough to others, they were still surprised inside. They asked Luo Feng about it through the virtual universe. Luo Feng's answer was simple. I met Blood Cloud Palace leader in the water area of Tilted Peak Sector. We got along very well, so we decided to adventure through the area together. Everything had been planned by an young master, who had been beaten by Luo Feng and Blood Cloud Palace leader. Thus far, his plan had failed, which upset an young master. If he couldn't kill Luo Feng, at least he could cause trouble for him. That was why he had started to spread the news. Blood Cloud Palace leader has lots of enemies, said an young master. His enemies will be hostile against you, Luo Feng. Humphrey, the more enemies you have, the more likely you'll be kicked when you're down. Just wait and see. An young master was patient. As a supreme being, he'd had a long life and he made himself an enemy of lots of other great beings. They had been hostile toward each other for an eternity. You dare to bully me? muttered an young master. And as a nobody, I won't let you get away with that so easily. I won't. An young master would take revenge for everything. When the great incarnation came, he would die as a great being from the first universe era. Also, he hadn't found any hope to survive the great incarnation. This was the true source of his anger. An young master only made some more enemies of Luo Feng. But Luo Feng didn't care much about it. Normal great beings won't make enemies, as they're afraid of having too many of them. I have star tower, and it seems I can get another supreme true treasure, which means I'm destined to be exceptional. The more enemies I have, the more chances I have to sharpen myself. Luo Feng was inside the cave between the first and the second light screen. He feared that it would be like last time. He went through the first light screen, and with the light screen, other great beings couldn't find him at all. The 100th time, Mo Shuo body had tried to get to that mysterious wing space 100 times. However, 
it had died every time as soon as he barely even entered the space, 100 times, and Moshe body only got to observe the surroundings twice. Luo Feng nodded, twice. Aside from that gigantic light wing, a storm surrounded it. Luo Feng made up his mind. I'll use star tower now. He sat on the cold rock between the first light screen and the second light screen. He kept his eyes closed and tried to calm himself down. After all, it wasn't easy to get a supreme true treasure, not to mention, to make one recognize him as its owner. He couldn't be arrogant or careless, he spent five minutes calming himself down and forgot about all the anxiety and excitement. Let's go. Luo Feng moved his mind. Hwa. A man in bloody armor showed up. It was Blood Cloud Palace leader. Golden Horned Beast will stay here and I'll go in, Luo Feng thought. He let his original earthling body get in, as he was the one wearing the Shi Wu wings. Luo Feng thought that might aid in getting those supreme true treasure like wings. Bigger, bigger, bigger. Luo Feng held Star Tower. Hwa, hwa, hwa. Star Tower bulged and grew into a tower 10,000 kilometers tall. Luo Feng stepped into the tower. Inside the control room of the tower, the metal ground was transparent. Luo Feng stood there. I can see everything outside. His mind was connected to Star Tower's core mind. Star Tower had a certain level of intelligence, but it was highly limited. It might be able to do calculations incredibly fast, but emotionally, it was equivalent to a baby. Everything out there showed up. It was like eternal simulation in which Luo Feng was able to see the rocks and the light screen on the outside. Move forward. Luo Feng controlled Star Tower, which started to fly. Shua. Second light screen, Luo Feng whispered and kept controlling Star Tower. Star Tower flew slowly, but it went through one light screen after another. Before long. It reached the ninth light screen. I'll now arrive in the mysterious space. Luo Feng gritted his teeth. He was bringing Star Tower, Shi Wu Wings, and Four Summer along with him. He couldn't afford to lose. I have to succeed. Luo Feng clenched his teeth and entered the ninth light screen. In the dark space, the blade formed a storm that swept across everything, and when Star Tower showed up, it was hit by the blade storm. It bounced away like a small boat in a tsunami. Damn it. Luo Feng felt a terrific shockwave attacking Star Tower. Hong, long, long. One blade of light after another attacked Star Tower. Each time, it was like hundreds of blades striking at once, which blasted Star Tower away like a toy. Star Tower was completely defenseless. Hit, hit. The blades of light kept hitting Star Tower which rolled like a soccer ball. Oh my god! said Liu Feng. He stayed in the control room, although Star Tower kept bouncing away. He didn't feel anything in the control room. He couldn't feel it, but he could see everything around it, including how Star Tower kept being blast away like a toy. He couldn't resist such powerful shock waves. Powerful. Too powerful. The blade light is terrifically powerful. Luo Feng had his godly power infused everywhere in Star Tower, so he could clearly sense the shock wave. The blades of light were much stronger than the techniques from Star Riven Master. Hundreds of times more powerful. The blades of light are incredibly powerful. Luo Feng thought, possibly more powerful than attacks from Universe Supreme Masters, although he had never fought a Universe Supreme Master, even Universe Supreme Masters were only stronger than Star River Master to a limited extent, yet the Blades of Light, each one made Luo Feng feel that it was much stronger than the ultimate technique of Star River Master, too powerful, if not for Star Tower. I would be killed instantly, Luo Feng thought. When he'd fought Star Riven Master, he had been slightly injured using the shuttle of Star Tower, so it was unsurprising that he would have been killed instantly by these blades, which were hundreds of times stronger. Luo Feng was right, Imperial Master had been in a top tier palace type true treasure, which couldn't even be destroyed by a Universe Supreme Master. However, he had been annihilated instantly, apparently. The Blade Storm was stronger than attacks from Universe Supreme Masters. The Blade Storm was extremely powerful. Even Liu Feng, 
who was incredibly strong, couldn't control Star Tower. It bounced away time and time again, smaller, smaller, smaller. Liu Feng kept controlling it. Shua. Star Tower shrank to the size of a grain of sand immediately. The original body of Star Tower was nine light years tall and it could get larger. It could also become as small as a tiny particle. This was the ability of a supreme true treasure. Star Tower had many interior spaces, but even when Star Tower shrank, and spaces weren't affected, normal treasures could also shrink, but not to the size of tiny particles. When it got smaller, Star Tower was only hit once in a while, as the blades of the storm were enormous, one blade alone won't affect Star Tower. Liu Feng felt he could fully control Star Tower now. Before, it had been flung about like a toy and couldn't be controlled. Now, it wouldn't be affected. After all, it was a supreme type true treasure. The light wing. Liu Feng stayed in the particle sized Star Tower. He looked at the endless storms outside and that glowing light wing. He flew Star Tower toward it immediately. Chapter 1172 Scram. The speed of Star Tower kept surging while the space was filled with blade storms, each of which was enormous. There were so many that Star Tower was hit once in a while and it couldn't fly on a straight line. So far, Liu Feng looked at the giant light wing in the distance. This mysterious space might have a diameter of over 10 light years, and the light wing is several light years away from me. However, space and time have been completely crushed so I can't do teleportation. Teleportation needed space ripples, only a little bit. However, the blades were more terrifying than attacks from Universe Supreme Masters so they would annihilate space, which left no ripples at all. Liu Feng had to fly to the white wings. Fortunately, I'm in Universe Ocean, where the speed limit is much higher than in the original universe, Liu Feng thought. The speed limit in Universe Ocean is 100 times faster than light speed, but because of the blade storm, Star Tower isn't able to hit the highest speed. Fortunately, it can still maintain an average speed of 50 times faster than light speed. Flying. Star Tower swiftly flew through the blade storms. Time flew. After a month, Star Tower had already flown more than 5 light years, and it was very close to those giant white wings. All those blade storms come from that white pair of wings. Liu Feng exclaimed, looking at the outside. He saw the edge of the white wings emanating endless light sweeping in the mysterious space. Some of the blade storms were absorbed by the white wings when they touched it. Erupting and absorbing. Erupt and absorb. Conversation of energy. Liu Feng thought. It looks almighty, but it actually only consumes little energy. Incredible. How incredible. Much more powerful than Five Color Aurora Lake. Five Color Aurora Lake was a supreme domain type true treasure so it was weaker in attacking power. Besides, when Double Face Ancestral God was fighting Virtual Real Devil Master, Five Color Aurora Lake hadn't been fully utilized. It wasn't deliberately conserved, but Double Face hadn't fully comprehended that. After all, it wasn't an easy task to wield the maximum power of a supreme true treasure. After another three days, Liuo Feng was very close to the giant white wings. This. Liuo Feng's facial expressions changed. He looked amazed before, but now, he was shocked. This, this, this is. It isn't a wing. No. From a distance, it had indeed appeared to be extremely breathtaking white wings more dazzling than billions of stars combined. However, when Liuo Feng got close enough, he saw that it wasn't a wing at all but a phantom formed by the overlapping of countless blade lights. Gosh. Liu Feng looked at everything with a thrill. In the distance, blade light overlapped with each other. On the edge, the blade light was thin, and the blade storms spread everywhere and enveloped the entire space. The closer it got to the center, the denser it was. A light wing formed by countless blades. Liu Feng exclaimed, where did all the blade lights come from? There must be a terrific true treasure. Liu Feng was exhilarated. He kept flying. After another day of flying, Liu Feng finally saw it clearly. At the center of the huge light wing was a white wing, 
around which was a wing-shaped space. Outside the space around the white wing was the combination of all the blade light. The blade light formed a giant wing-shaped silhouette of light several light years tall, which formed blade storms. The origin seems to be that white wing. Luo Feng's eyes gleamed. At the same time, the Shi Wu wings on his back started to tremble as if they wanted to fly toward that white wings. I have to get it. Luo Feng held his breath. The closer it got, the slower Star Tower became. 100 million kilometers. 10 million kilometers. 1 million kilometers. So, this is what it looks like. Luo Feng kept observing the wings as he was now able to see them clearly with his naked eyes. The pair of white wings was 100 meters tall and spread wide open. They looked white because they were covered with dimming white light and the material was white, but actually, it was covered with dust. Closer, the closer Luo Feng got, the clearer he saw it. It was a pair of white wings with blood stains on it. 100,000 kilometers. 60,000 kilometers. 30,000 kilometers. Scram, scram, scram. A mental force suddenly hit Luo Feng, which stupefied him. The mind contacting him was extremely overbearing. It made him feel like an ant facing off against a tiger. Luckily, Luo Feng was able to stay conscious. Something's wrong thought Liu Feng. He found that the mind was hollow. Scram. The words of the mind kept attacking him, but he was able to stay calm. Hollow, thought Liu Feng. Although it's got terrific power, more so than Hugh Jack's founder, it's intangible. Liu Feng concentrated his mind. Kept going forward, but slow down. 20,000 kilometers. 15,000 kilometers. 10,000 kilometers. The mind kept roaring but it wasn't difficult to resist it. Scram, scram. Luo Feng dealt with it calmly and without fear. Star Tower had the power to guard the soul, so it could resist soul attacks as well as material attacks. As for crushing mental force, it was like a devilish force attacking him. It could, at most, crush one's mind, but as long as one kept his distance, his mind could quickly recover. Star Tower continued slowing down. 5,000 kilometers. 4,000 kilometers. 3.000 kilometers. It kept getting closer. That crushing mental force kept getting stronger, and it kept roaring, Scram, bastard, scram. Otherwise, I'll kill you. You would have done that already if you could, Luo Feng said with a smirk. Besides, I'm in Star Tower. Even Universe Supreme Masters can't do anything to me let alone you, a simple and stupid mental force. It was, indeed, simple and stupid. That crushing mental force did feel superior, but the only thing it was able to do was roar and swear. When Liu Feng tried to merge with Blood River Crystals, that devilish force knew how to form illusions, unlike this crushing mind, which only knew how to roar and swear. Rat bastard, rat bastard, scram, otherwise, I'll kill you. I'll rip your soul off your body. I'll make you regret for the rest of your life. The crushing mind grew increasingly angrier the closer Luo Feng got. Luo Feng didn't care. The mind wouldn't threaten him if it could really kill him. Even those beasts on the earth were more intelligent than the wing. Bastard. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. You'll regret it. 2,000 kilometers. 1,000 kilometers. Luo Feng really felt the difficulty of the task now. He was thrilled, as his willpower was at the universe master level. He wouldn't be affected if he was hit by other universe masters. Perhaps only a mental attack from universe supreme masters would affect him. However, this mind was not that of any great being. Otherwise, it wouldn't have been so primitive. Yet the strength was still terrific. So strange. Normally, distance doesn't matter when it comes to mental attacks, Luo Feng thought. Mental attacks from 10,000 kilometers would be no different from those from 100,000 kilometers. Is it converging? Luo Feng moved his mind and turned Star Tower. It had been drawing closer along a straight line. Now, it was following a curve. The several spots 800 kilometers away have the same level of attack, low wisdom, and the mind attack can't be concentrated. Although he was baffled, Luo Feng kept moving forward. 
800 kilometers, 600 kilometers, 400 kilometers, 200 kilometers. The mental attack kept getting stronger. Liu Feng started to sweat, and his eyes glinted fiercely and madly. So strong. 100 kilometers. Liu Feng kept moving forward slowly. The mind attack was much stronger. In such a short distance, the mind attack got denser and more oppressing, and it surged exponentially. 80 kilometers. Liu Feng appeared to be in agony. 60 kilometers. Liu Feng's godly body started to shake. 50 kilometers. Liu Feng knelt down on one knee. His godly body was trembling. He clenched his teeth as if he were being attacked by a giant beast. Huh? Liu Feng had seen three blood stains on the white wing before, but now that he was 50 kilometers away, he saw three scratches on those exquisite white wings. They looked like scratches made by a weapon and the structures of the wings were a bit damaged. A broken wing? Liu Feng was dazed. Chapter 1173 The Spirit of a Supreme True Treasure There were three scratches on the fine lines of the blood-stained white wings. Liu Feng was baffled. Any one of those blade rays that spread all over space during the endless blade storm was even more frightening than the attack of any universe supreme master. This pair of white wings was undoubtedly a supreme true treasure. Based on common knowledge, supreme true treasures could not be damaged, even within the three most dangerous lands. The same theory applied. Damaged? How can it be damaged? Liu Feng was confused. Scratches? How did that happen? Which dreadfully scary fellow could have scratched it? Or was it caused by a certain uniquely dangerous environment within the core domain of the three most dangerous lands? Various thoughts flooded Liu Feng's mind instantly. Something that could scratch these supreme true treasure wings, and even stain them with blood. There must have been a story behind this. Although he was shocked and confused, Liu Feng managed to stay level-headed. Since setting foot in Universe Ocean, he had grown to understand the area better through the information he acquired and had gained an understanding about certain matters. The Universe Ocean was simply too mysterious. The great beings of any reincarnation era could only live up to a maximum of three reincarnation eras, apart from the two holy grounds. Up to that very day. No one was able to explore beyond the boundaries of Universe Ocean. A large quantity of miniature universes, including the countless ones that had been destroyed, were all limited in size. Except for the two Holy Grounds universes, they were extremely big. A miniature universe was the creation of a universe supreme master. As for the two existences that left behind the two Holy Grounds miniature universes, what level would their powers have reached? Until now, there was no relevant information. To be able to scratch this pair of supreme true treasure wings, I guess only the two existences who created the two holy grounds universes could achieve that, Liu Feng hypothesized. But there is no information about them at all. Of course, he was only speculating. The universe ocean was full of secrets. Even he was in a state of bewilderment. He looked at the pair of white wings from afar, those dazzling wings. Something must have happened to them, but I cannot be bothered. What I need to do now is to get a hold of this supreme true treasure. Liu Feng knelt on one knee and placed both palms on the floor to endure crazy waves of oppressive willpower. That self-contented and insane willpower was roaring. Get lost. You bastard. Get lost, or I will kill you. Kill you. Advance. Liu Feng gritted his teeth as he manipulated Star Tower. The oppressive willpower was frightening. The intensity was only second to the time when Star Tower had gone through a life and death ordeal. Back then, the pain during the fusion with Tower Pearl had been excruciating. The pain now was quite tormenting, but it was nothing compared to the previous one. 45 kilometers. 40 kilometers. This oppressive willpower spread in all directions, and the closer it got to the White Wings, the more intense the oppression was. This intensity did not increase by mere degrees. Instead, it was a surge in level. 36 kilometers. 34 kilometers. 32 kilometers. 30 kilometers. 28 kilometers. Ah! Liu Feng trembled all over. His eyes were bloodshot, and blood was pulsating through his veins. The surrounding space around him trembled as his muscles, viscera, 
and Bones howled as though his life depended on it, even Liu Feng found it so unbearable that he had to let out a small cry, pain, it was horrendous agony, I can tolerate it, this is not the limit yet, Liu Feng said, telling himself to bear with the pain, he was closing on the distance, 22 kilometers, 20 kilometers, 18 kilometers, Liu Feng was starting to get attacks of syncope, intermittently blacking out, the oppressive willpower was making him fall into a deep slumber, yet it also seemed to be easing up on him while continuing to roar, bastard, loathsome bastard, you think you can get close to me, ha ha, far from it, bastard, quickly take your leave, and I shall spare your life, stop, Liu Feng gritted his teeth but still was unable to stop them from chattering, at 16 kilometers away, he finally stopped, this was only a hair's breadth away from the true limit between life and death, but it was already dangerously near, Liu Feng dared not intrude further, the white wings were still unleashing endless blades, which gave form to those dazzling, gigantic light wings, at 16 kilometers away from the white wings, star tower stopped, in the main control room, Liu Feng was seated cross-legged with his eyes closed, silently fighting the impact by the oppressive willpower, thereafter, he eased into gradual adaptation to the impact, the oppression was gradually reduced, after half a year, Liu Feng opened his eyes, under such suppression, my own willpower was able to undergo a honing process, allowing me to steal myself, this was my gain after all, Liu Feng smiled, then, he looked out at the white wings, I must lay hands on this pair of wings, Liu Feng said with an intention in mind, right away, a trace of godly power flew out of Star Tower, as the white wings released blade rays on a two-dimensional plane level to its light wings, there were no blade rays at the front or back of it for a full 10,000 kilometers, gigantic, dazzling light wings that spread out to give rise to a blade storm might have swept through space, yet 10,000 kilometers from the closest two sides of these white wings, there was not a single trace of a blade ray to be found, godly power, get closer, Liu Feng manipulated his thread of godly power and directed it toward the white wings, get lost, the oppressive willpower charged at his godly power right away, peng, godly power dispersed, every trace of godly power had its own life imprints and willpower and thus, naturally would be easily annihilated, seems like this is not going to work, star tower, grow longer, Liu Feng manipulated from within, longer, 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 star tower grew longer rapidly, and its tower peak got nearer to the white wings, however, the godly power from within star tower was still under the impact of that oppressive willpower, so even though the tower was growing bigger, the godly power it could exert was partial where the topmost region of the tower peak remaining void of godly power, who con to it, star tower was a nine story tower, so naturally, its edges would be able to hook onto the wings, as star tower grew increasingly larger, gradually closing the distance to the white wings, finally, the tower reached the white wings, the edge of the tower was a full 100 kilometers, and the white wings were only 100 meters, so, theoretically speaking, holding onto the white wings should be easy, Peng, the moment Star Tower's peak touched the white wings, the feeling evoked felt as though an ant had rammed against a mighty mountain, the wings did not even budge, I'm ramming into them, yet they did not move at all, Liu Feng could not believe his eyes, first, he maneuvered Star Tower into moving back slightly, then he charged forward suddenly while accelerating, bang, hong, star towers peak rammed into the white wings ruthlessly, yet the white wings continued to unleash endless blade rays that converged to form dazzling light wings, star towers attempt to crash into the white wings proved futile, damn, this, this, Liu Feng's eyes widened, back when star tower was involved in battles in the outer domain, it was a treasure without a master, so it could not move about on its own, but due to its massive size, other great beings were unable to move it either, this pair of white wings before me is small, said Liu Feng, the wings are only 100 meters in size, yet my star tower, after reaching a massive size of a few thousand kilometers, is unable to cause it to budge at all, 
peng, 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 star tower was like a mallet banging the ancient, massive bell, ramming into the sides of the white wings from a horizontal angle repeatedly, it even retreated to accelerate to a dozen times the speed of light to continue ramming into the white wings. It really is not moving at all? Luo Feng was a little stunned. What should I do? If my godly power wanted to get closer but is unable to, then there is no way I can get hold of those white wings. Luo Feng was getting frustrated. It was a piece of supreme true treasure that was only 16 kilometers away in midair, but it was unleashing endless power, demonstrating its capability. Luo Feng was at his wit's end. Time passed with Luo Feng thinking of new ways to try every day. Yet every trial resulted in failure. However, Luo Feng was reluctant to give up. After all, this was a supreme true treasure. Luo Feng could now empathize with the helplessness the four pinnacle races felt when they had all fought hard for Star Tower, but none had been able to get the tower to recognize a master. With a twinkling of an eye, nine days passed. Bastard, get lost. There is no way you can lay hands on the wings. Get lost. Don't court your doom. The oppressive willpower had never stopped for a breather, but Luo Feng had grown accustomed to the impact of this oppressive willpower. Suddenly, an intangible wave transmitted by the white wings in a split second reached deep within Star Tower and into Luo Feng's mind. Human, an ancient voice said, sitting cross-legged. Luo Feng's eyes lit up. He clearly felt a willpower that was different from the first one. Who are you? I am the spirit of the wing's true treasure. The ancient voice said. Luo Feng was a little taken aback but not completely shocked. It was just like how his supreme true treasure, Star Tower, had a spirit of its own, albeit with a low intelligence level. It was like a child easily coaxed. This pair of wings seemed to be much more mature. I did not expect this. The ancient voice said, that I would actually have a component in the outside world. You did not expect to. Luo Feng was shocked. I once joined my master in a major battle where he was annihilated. The ancient voice explained. His wings were damaged, and the original spirit of the wings was also destroyed. I am a newly born spirit so I can only recall snippets of the battle. I vaguely recall one blow from our enemy, but the rest is entirely forgotten. Since birth, I have been here. I thought I was a sole existence, but it seems like there are another two pairs of wings. Judging from their powers, though, I must be the core, while the other two pairs constitute parts of me. Luo Feng was secretly awestruck. A major battle? Damaged wings with the original spirit destroyed? How did you know that your master had been annihilated? Luo Feng could not help asking. I am an object without a master, so naturally my master must have been annihilated, the spirit of the wings said. Human, I have been trapped here for countless ages. I want to leave, but I am unable to. I need your help. Help? Luo Feng asked persistently. How can I help you? There are four blood stains on my wings, the spirit of the wings began. Within each blood stain, there is a terrifying power and will power for time beyond measure. I have been suppressing it, wanting to destroy it. In all that time, I only managed to expel one. There are three remaining. Only if I can suppress and expel them all can my full potential be unleashed. Do you see the injury on my wings? Yes, Luo Feng replied. I'm injured. Expelling the three bloodstains is difficult. I need some precious true treasures. I will have to swallow these true treasures to facilitate my self-restoration. Now, I need your help. If you can provide me with enough true treasures to help my self-restoration, I am willing to recognize you as my master. But do bear in mind that I have very stringent requirements when it comes to recognizing a master. 1. You must have the perfect life genes. 2. Your willpower must be strong enough. If you are an undying fighter, your willpower must be comparable to a universe knight. If you are a universe knight, your willpower must be comparable to a universe master. If you are a universe master, your willpower must be comparable to a universe supreme master. What a pity. I see that your willpower is only on the level of a universe master. You still need to improve and increase further. Listening to the voice of this spirit of the wings, Luo Feng was extremely calm. But suddenly, 
his heart gave a sudden throb, something is not right, a sudden realization dawned upon Liu Feng, it is lying to me, chapter 1174, spirit, the universe perceived that it was not dangerous to make true treasures recognize someone as their master, Liu Feng had a different experience as he tried to make Star Tower recognize him as its master, he knew exactly how dangerous it was, if he got killed and some great being tried to make Star Tower recognize him as its master, Tower Pearl was strong enough to kill that great being, when the spirit of the wing true treasure conveyed a message to Liu Feng's mind, he was extremely careful, as he didn't want to lose his life trying to make a supreme true treasure recognize it as its master, which was why he kept pondering what the spirit said, the conditions for recognizing someone as a master, perfect gene level and powerful willpower, he fit them both, he had a perfect gene level, and he had the willpower of a universe master as a universe knight, I'll see what sort of games you're playing. Liuo Feng thought, the feeble ripples permeated and penetrated Liuo Feng's mind, they kept talking to each other, the two conditions you just mentioned, Liuo Feng was overjoyed as he said, I fit them both, my life gene level is perfect, and I'm a universe knight, you fit them both, you're a universe knight, aren't you a universe master, I am a universe knight, said Liuo Feng, don't lie, said the spirit, you won't be able to make me recognize you as a master if you don't fit the conditions, wang, 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 the wing on Liuo Feng's back kept shaking, actually, the Shi Wu wings had been shaking intensely in the cave outside, it had been several months since Liuo Feng had arrived at the mysterious space, and the Shi Wu wings kept shaking, the closer it got, the more intense it shook, Liuo Feng was only able to make sure that his Shi Wu wings didn't fly out, I'm not lying, I am a universe knight and have perfect life gene level, said Liuo Feng, I fulfilled both the criteria, but I can't make you recognize me as your owner, my godly power can't even be near you, you mean the mind that hit you? The spirit said, the mind came from those three blood stains, and it's suppressed by me, I'm trying to get it off me, so it's been struggling, it doesn't want any other life forms to approach me, once I recognize someone else as my owner, I'll recover more quickly if I have an owner to help me, which is why it tried everything to stop you, I see, said Liuo Feng, if you want me to recognize you as my master, it's pretty simple, though you can't get close to me, I can fly a part of my core out, as long as you grab that component and make it recognize you as its master, I will, too, Liuo Feng was thrilled, that's right, I can't get close, but if a part of your core leaves your body, I can surely grab it, but why should I trust you, human, said the spirit, what, Liuo Feng was dazed, I am broken, and I need to be repaired, repaired with some true treasure material, and I wish for my master to help me, said the spirit, I've told you that I'll recognize someone who can help me repair myself, I need you to show your sincerity and give me some material of a true treasure to help me recover, the precious material of a true treasure, at least enough material to make a pinnacle true treasure, said the spirit, you expect me to have that sort of material, said Liuo Feng, or a pinnacle true treasure, said the spirit, I know you have lots of pinnacle true treasures on you, like the blade you're carrying, Liuo Feng looked hesitant, I need to repair myself, the spirit said, sounding a bit irritated, you won't need that blade anymore when you have me, I'll be much stronger, it's time to show your sincerity, give me the material, I'll absorb some, and I'll give you the core, you can lose one pinnacle true treasure now, the more you invest in me, the more you'll value me in the future, said the spirit, I need to make sure you're determined to repair me, otherwise, I won't be able to change anything once I recognize you as my master, if you can't even do this, I won't be able to trust you, then I'll wait until the next great being come, am I the first one here? asked Liuo Feng, no, two came before, said the spirit, a universe master came not long before, he was flying a top tier palace true treasure, but I killed him instantly, there was another one a long time ago, right after I was born, he came here in a pinnacle palace true treasure, 
and he talked with me for a long time. He told me a lot about the outer world. He let me know about universe masters and universe knights. He's the first life form I saw. I wasn't intelligent back then, and I was willing to recognize him as my master. Unfortunately, he didn't have a powerful mind. He often came here to sharpen it quickly and helped me look for the material. However, I lost track of him after some time. He hasn't been here for an eternity. He may have died. The spirit sighed. Liu Feng listened carefully. That superior mind kept hitting Liu Feng. It's the wing. The wing. It's terrifying. It'll kill you if you don't go. It kept roaring. It'll kill you. It'll kill you. Liu Feng stayed calm. Give me the material of a pinnacle true treasure, or a pinnacle true treasure, said the spirit. I don't think you'll care about one pinnacle true treasure, given your power. Are you not willing to trade one pinnacle true treasure? The mind from the blood stains scared you? It fears that I'll eliminate it which is why it keeps telling you to leave. I'm not going to urge you anymore. Make your own decision. The spirit went quiet. Liu Feng started to contact the spirit of his star tower. Star tower, that pair of white wings just told me the conditions for me to become its master. Liu Feng told the spirit of star tower everything. Star tower wasn't intelligent enough but its operational speed might be quicker than that of a universe supreme master. Is it a trap? asked Liu Feng. A mental wave emanated from the spirit of Star Tower. Master, lots of sector lords, undying fighters, and even universe supreme masters have ventured inside me. I've gathered lots of information. However, I don't know much about other supreme true treasures. I can't find anything deceiving about what the spirit of the wings just said. Okay. Liu Feng nodded, silence. Star Tower shrank to 100 meters and floated beside the white wings. It was natural for Liu Feng to be hesitant. After all, everyone knew that it was difficult to make a supreme true treasure recognize someone as its master. When a great being wasn't sure, he wouldn't just give away a pinnacle true treasure. Was he willing to take such a gamble? Normally, great beings would be willing to risk it. After all, only those great beings with at least a pinnacle palace true treasure could make it to the spirit of the wing. Hence, for those great beings, they would be willing to trade a pinnacle true treasure for a supreme true treasure. After all, there was only one chance, which was why the spirit of the wing wasn't rushing anything. I'm not going to rush anything, either, thought Liu Feng. I'll spend the time sharpening my willpower. It's set me up and it won't be able to wait for too long. I'll see what it's going to play next. It won't be able to do anything to me as long as I stay in Star Tower. Liu Feng was pretty sure that the spirit of the wing was lying to him. It thinks it's smart, but it doesn't realize that its story is flawed. Liu Feng thought, I'll wait and see. Liu Feng started to wait. Time flew by and Liu Feng got closer and closer to the white wing. That willpower kept hitting him, but it was a fantastic chance for Liu Feng to sharpen his own willpower. He kept moving forward while challenging the limit of his willpower. After six years, Star Tower was only 15 kilometers away from the white wings. The Shi Wu wings on Liu Feng trembled more intensely. I. I, a ripple came from Shi Wu wing. Liu Feng was startled. The terrifying mind hit him forcing him to drive Star Tower back to 20 kilometers away from the White Wing. Only at that point was he able to resist that pressure and stabilize himself. That triple? Liu Feng was startled. I, I. A feeble ripple came from Shi Wu Wing. Shi Wu Wings? Shi Wu Wings? Liu Feng was shocked. Those ripples were coming from his Shi Wu Wings? A spirit had been born in Shi Wu Wing, a top tier true treasure. No. It must have been a component of a supreme true treasure. That pair of white wings was also a component, but it was much stronger. A spirit had been born in those white wings, but that didn't mean his Shi Wu wings couldn't have a spirit. However, why had the spirit only shown up now? He'd been waiting for the next step from those white wings, but a spirit had been born in his Shi Wu wings. I, I, the ripples were feeble. At first, they couldn't even convey a message. After six days, it managed to send the first message. I, Mas. T, like a baby, the spirit of Shi Wu Wing was weak. However, Liu Feng remained patient. Time went by, 
and the spirit grew more mature. After almost a year, it was finally able to converse with Liu Feng. A mental ripple was sent, Master, I want to get out. Out? Asked Liu Feng. To where? I want to. I want to eat the light outside. Said the weak cripple. Light. The light of the origin. That's the origin. What's the origin? Asked Liu Feng. The origin is there. Said the feeble ripple. Broken memories. There are six pairs of wings in my memories. The origin is there. I need the light. The light from the origin. Liu Feng was completely bewildered. These wings? Chapter 1175, Recognizing its master. As the spirit of Shi Wu wings was newly born and was not very clear in expressing itself, Liu Feng was naturally extremely patient with it, spending almost half a day's time before he finally gained some understanding. Although this spirit had just been born. It did have some snippets of memories. It did not remember scenes of battle and fighting, rather, it remembered the looks of its previous owners. Its previous owner, based on what the spirit of Shi Wu Wings said, was a giant with two horns and a towering godly body that had six pairs of wings. Shi Wu Wings made up two out of those six pairs of wings. And the spirit of Shi Wu Wings was absolutely certain that its six pairs of wings were comparable to one another. Every pair was equally important. Within the structure of the entire true treasure, every pair had its own unique function. A missing pair would deprive the true treasure of true perfection. Then why is it so powerful? Liu Feng asked. The spirit of Shi Wu Wings explained that it was because of its origin. Origin referred to the core of all six pairs of wings. Based on the communication with Shi Wu Wings and the understanding he gained from it, its origin worked in a way similar to a car engine, and it had storage efficiency. Its previous owner was very powerful and much of his godly power had needed to undergo conversion by the origin before it could be stored. That was the significance of the origin's existence, and that was why this pair of wings was so powerful. I have to obtain it, but how do I do it? Liu Feng asked. Get it to recognize you as its master, Shi Wu said. How do I get it to recognize me as its master? Liu Feng continued to press for answers. When a master imprints his godly power on the wings, the moment life imprints are in place, the wings will recognize its master, Shi Wu said, then anxiously added, but master, I am a newborn spirit, and that pair of wings has a spirit, too. Toward the end, when fusion is completed, we two spirits will have to attack and fight each other to the death. One will swallow the other, until finally, there is only one spirit left. Master, if there comes a time to recognize our masters, you must help me. Only you can help me. Then I will be able to devour it. Liu Feng sighed to himself. It was only half a day of interaction, but the more the spirit of Shi Wu Wings spoke, the stronger its ability in exchanging information grew. All right, I will help you. Liu Feng nodded. Shi Wu had been with him the moment it was born. On the other hand, the spirit of the pair of white wings harbored ill intentions. If he had to choose, it would obviously be better to choose Shi Wu. But Shi Wu, with my godly power, I am unable to get close to that pair of wings. What should I do? Liu Feng asked. Shi Wu was the spirit of a true treasure. When it was first born, it would naturally be clear on its requirements for recognizing its master. Recognizing a master is difficult, said Shi Wu because that pair of white wings has an origin within it, and that origin is its core. The spirit born within that pair of wings was actually a spirit born with the origin as its main body. For us other kinds of wings, we can recognize someone as our masters easily, but it is different for the white pair of wings. The difficulty level for it to recognize someone as its master matches that of a complete wing true treasure. What are the requirements? Liu Feng questioned further. The requirements for willpower are high, Shi Wu explained. For a Sektu Lord, the willpower must match that of a Universe Knight. For an Undying Fighter, the willpower must match that of a Universe Master. For a Universe Knight, their willpower must match that of a Universe Supreme Master. For a Universe Supreme Master, their willpower must exceed that of one beyond a universe supreme master. Liu Feng was astounded. He continued to bombard Shi Wu with more questions, 
beyond the universe supreme master, that really exists? Yes, I vaguely remember so from the snippets of my memories, Shi Wu said. There is a much stronger existence than the universe supreme master that master knows of, my previous master was one of them. Liu Feng took a deep breath. Really? It was indeed true. Countless great beings within Universe Ocean had speculated about this, especially the Universe Masters from the Two Holy Grounds. Those Universe Masters were especially arrogant and regarded their Universe Ancestors as far superior to the ancestors of the various other Universe Supreme Masters. They even considered their ancestors to be more powerful than Teacher Origin who was said to be invincible. They shouted aloud that their universe ancestors were extremely powerful, that their universe ancestors were invincible. Yet no one had met those two before. However, it did not matter whether it was Teacher Origin or the other universe supreme beings. To the largely damaged miniature universe, they were all considered to be only slightly bigger, the two holy grounds that had two universes were the ones that were massive. The two holy grounds had undergone umpteen rounds of reincarnation, which had caused the other 100 plus powers to be wary of the legendary universe masters of these two holy grounds. In their hearts, they had identified with the fact that these two universe ancestors were possibly terrifying. It was just that no one had met them before. Countless eras. No one had met them before. Therefore, everyone took them to be non-existent. Shi Wu Wing's previous master was a being that was more powerful than a universe supreme master. Liu Feng was stunned. Really? It turns out to be true. There really is an existence that is more powerful than a universe supreme master. Seems like the universe ancestors of the two holy grounds may have surpassed that level. Could it be? For my miniature universe to achieve eternal existence, I have to surpass a universe supreme master? Liu Feng came to a conclusion. Eternity was a difficult objective to achieve. Countless miniature universes had been destroyed. Only those of the two holy grounds had managed to survive clearly showing the difficulty level. Seems like this has implicated some of the secrets of Universe Ocean, Liu Feng thought. Liu Feng buried all these thoughts deep within him. After all, in the vast Universe Ocean, where great beings gathered in great numbers, with that modest amount of power he had, he was still far from having a pristine understanding of those secrets of Universe Ocean. Shi Wu, you mentioned recognizing someone as its master? Liu Feng could not contain his questions. The requirements are so high. Master, you are a universe knight, so your willpower must match that of a universe supreme master, Shi Wu said. I am not so sure about the other extremely powerful true treasures, but I know that it is the case for that pair of white wings. After all, they were both wings born from the same origin, so naturally, Shi Wu would understand the White Wings well. What if I cannot reach that level of willpower? Liu Feng pressed. Then you cannot succeed, Shi Wu replied without hesitation. At most, you failed to get it to recognize you as its master. Your life will not be in any form of danger. Recognizing someone as its master does not have any relation to life gene level? Asked Liu Feng. Not at all. Shi Wu answered with certainty. Liu Feng's pupils contracted as he squinted. He had found the White Wings suspicious earlier on. Now that Shi Wu had been born, from the various information he had acquired from Shi Wu, there was clearly no relation between recognizing a master and life gene level. Actually, thinking back to when he'd gotten Star Tower to recognize him as its owner, his life genes had not been involved at all. And the spirit of that pair of White Wings had lied to him lied by saying that a universe knight would need the willpower of a universe master. The truth was otherwise, a universe knight would require the willpower of a universe supreme master. Shi Wu, Liu Feng said, previously, when I was interacting with that pair of white wings, Liu Feng told Shi Wu every detail about the previous conversation he had with the pair of white wings. It is lying to you, master, it is lying to you. Shi Wu said quickly, your current willpower, master, is not enough at all. It will be too dangerous. I suspect that it is tricking you into believing that it will recognize you as its master. It is highly possible that it wants to kill you, master. Just one of the rays from its wings could annihilate you. I am already aware of that, Shi Wu. Tell me, 
what should I do to get hold of it? When master's willpower has reached an appropriate level, there are two ways. One is to imprint your godly power on that pair of wings. Once imprinted, your godly power will naturally spread to every inch of the wings. She Wu elaborated further, the other way is to get the pair of white wings to hand over its core origin. Once its origin makes its way to master, master can imprint his godly power onto its origin. Then it would have to recognize you as its master. But it has to be the origin. Any other individual component would be useless. Liu Feng nodded. He understood. Just like how Star Tower recognized him as its master, it had to be Tower Pearl fusing with the soul. If any other component within Star Tower, for instance, a sealed star, attempted to recognize someone as its master, it would not be of any help to Star Tower at all. Master, you should wait. Shi Wu continued. Wait patiently. If that pair of white wings starts to panic, then there might be a chance. So long as it gets its origin to fly out, I can clearly judge whether that is its origin or not. By then, Master can trap its origin within Star Tower. Star Tower is extremely powerful. If the origin is trapped within one of its space, it would definitely be able to escape. Master, you may as well loosen up for a long, slow wait. Go hone your willpower until your willpower reaches the threshold. Then you can obtain the origin to make it recognize you as its master. Liu Feng nodded. All right, I will wait. With the passing of time, the spirit of Shi Wu grew rapidly and at a visible range. Its intelligence level was not high, but its operational speed was extremely high. So when it came to the dissemination of information, it was naturally even clearer and more lucid. Shi Wu was rearranging the snippets of its memories, then combining them with the various materials gathered from the present day universe ocean to churn out a large number of deductions. Another three years passed. Finally, the pair of white wings transmitted a communication wave to Liu Feng. Human, the spirit of the white wings said. Liu Feng laughed to himself. Indeed, it had come looking for him. Are you stalling for time on purpose? Began the spirit of the white wings. You know that I want to self-restore, you have unlimited life. You have come to know that this place is a good place for honing your willpower and that it is hard to come by, so you are not in any hurry, right? Right, Liu Feng replied honestly. You are very straightforward, but you are not willing to take out a single pinnacle true treasure, the spirit of the white wings said. That is very disappointing. I'm not willing to take the gamble, said Liu Feng. If I failed, wouldn't I be losing a pinnacle true treasure? A pinnacle true treasure is very important to me. I am much stronger than a pinnacle true treasure, the spirit of the white wings said. But you have yet to recognize anyone as your master. Liu Feng replied. Why should you be so insistent about my giving you a pinnacle true treasure first? If you recognize me as your master, I will own you, an extremely powerful true treasure. Naturally, I will find ways to make you even more powerful. A super great being only needs a few true treasures that suit himself. No one great being, after owning a true treasure such as yourself, would let your potential go to waste by not finding ways to boost your ability. Silence. Soon after, the spirit of the White Wings retreated. Liu Feng closed his eyes and continued to train his willpower. He was in no rush at all. In the blink of an eye, another three years went by. The communication wave came along again. All right, I concede defeat, the spirit of the White Wings admitted. Ha ha ha, don't worry, said Liu Feng. So long as you recognize me as your master. I will definitely find ways to restore you and allow your power to grow tremendously. You are my trump card. Wings, this process about recognizing your master, it requires your core component, doesn't it? Yes, the pair of white wings said. I am now going to release a core component. Grab it and imprint your godly power. Then I will have to recognize you as my master. I hope you won't disappoint me. I will not disappoint you. Liu Feng said, Hwa. a speck of light came flying out of the edge of the pair of white wings. The very next moment, the densely gathered blade rays were sent flying away in random directions due to the impact of the collision. They were sent tens of thousands of kilometers away. At times, 
a random blade ray would happen to hit this speck of light right in its middle. Far away, amidst the endless blade storm, that speck of light was flying about haphazardly. Shi Wu, is that the origin? Luo Feng asked quickly. No, master, said Shi Wu, the origin is the source of those lights. If it flies out, then countless blade rays will be following it around as it flies. It is the true core of the endless rays. That is fake. I am sure of it. There is a blade ray concealed within it. If you try to get it to recognize you as your master, the blade will attack you right away. Then master will die. 